Did the Ethiopian National Defense Force and the Tigray's People Liberation Front fighters commit violations amounting to war crimes under international law? Yes, according to a UN report unveiled Monday. Ethiopia's permanent representative to the UN in Geneva rejected Tuesday the findings of the investigators. The report itself is self-contradictory, self-contradictory and biased, which doesn't uh, um, uh, pay any attention to the atrocities committed in Afar and Amahara region, but solely, solely uh, uh, focusing on Tigray. After almost two years of conflict in Tigray, millions of people lack food. The report claims federal authorities used starvation as a method of warfare. The only source they talk to is the TPLF itself. They wrote in their report what was dictated by the TPLF itself. Otherwise, there is no any single evidence that shows the government of Ethiopia used uh, 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 humanitarian aid as instrument of war. UN investigators conducted interviews during which witnesses testified. Crimes cited in the report include murder and rape. Fighting between government forces and their allies and rebels led by the TPLF reignited in August.